こんばんは、みーチャンネルです。こんばんは、マークです。Welcome to our channel. ようこそ。元気ですかはい、元気です。What's our Japanese word for this week? This week. 大丈夫。大丈夫はい。What's this 大丈夫 ?What's this mean? Are you okay? I'm okay. Are ah. you okay? I'm okay.、Ah. So it's similar to we, when we did Genki. So you can use it as a question and as the answer.、Ah, right. Yes.、Mm. So you don't say Daijoubu desu ka. Daijoubu desu ka is pleasant. Yes, but normally with friends, just Daijoubu. Ah,、uh, if friends <coughs> looks like sad, Daijoubu. Yes. Right. <laughs> 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 yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> Or if Maybe someone makes a little mistake. Ah, I don't know. Ah, I don't know. Ah, good. Hi. Okay. Can you say it slowly? Dai jo bu. Okay. Dai jo bu. Hi. Okay. Excellent. Hi. So, if you come to Japan and you want to use dai jo bu, you can、uh, sometimes maybe in a restaurant or something, they might say, oh, we don't have. The dish you're looking for, or is they might ask,、uh, is this okay? Da jobu desu ka? Show you something, then. So, you want to say da jobu? Yeah. Good. Okay. Yes. Yes. Excellent. So, next is our Japanese food. Ah,、uh, do you know natto? Natto, yes, I know natto. Do you like natto? I, natto is soso. Soso, huh? You、yes. don't like. I, 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 don't, I don't like means that if I eat natto, it's not nice. But for me, natto is soso. I can、mm. eat natto,、mm. easy. But if, if I had a choice of, on a menu, I wouldn't pick natto.、Mm. But,、uh, when we go out with your friends for the first time, or、oh, every time there,、mm. you have to eat natto.、Mm. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, yes. So it's like a test for a foreigner when you come to Japan,、uh, and you work with Japanese people. They probably try and get you to eat natto first. For the, they think maybe it's for the first time because it's fun for Japanese people to see the、mm. reaction. Yeah. Yes, yes, yeah. yes. So maybe some people eat it and go, <laughs> don't like that. But、mm. for me, natto is okay、oh. because、mm. um, in school,、mm. elementary school, maybe once or twice a month, we have、mm. natto. So you get used to the taste. Pretty deadly. Healthy. Beans, healthy. Yes. But the. the One thing about natto is the smell is not very nice.、Mm. Yeah.、Mm. <laughs> so, where is natto from? From? Yeah. So,、uh, which prefecture? Mito.、Uh, Mito? Mito City. Mito City?、Mm. Ah, interesting.、Mm. Yeah. So, and also,、um, you can get natto in different forms. So, you can get like natto sushi.、Mm. You can get like、uh, sometimes bowls of natto, natto and rice. What are the kinds of natto? Uh, natomaki. Natomaki? What's natomaki? Natomaki is rice,、yeah. rice, and like a sea bean,、yeah. rice, natto roll. Ah, so like a sushi roll. Yeah.、Mm. Ah, okay,、Hi. good. Yeah. So do you like natto? Yes. 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 Natto miso soup, natto with, with tofu. Yes. Natto, only natto. On its own. Not always rice. Yes. Morning, Japanese people. Yes. Morning time. Yes. But, but for foreign people. Not all toast. Not all toast. Ah, not too bad.、Hi. But if, if you come to Japan first time, don't be surprised if you don't like natto. <laughs>、mm. Because it's one of those tastes. It's like,、um, you, you lived in Australia. So did you ever try,、um, so Vegemite? Hi. Yes.、Mm. So. s o r t of. Yes.、Mm. So veg, it's like Vegemite if you're.、Mm. From the States,、uh, or if you're from、um, the UK or Ireland, Marmite. It's the same、yeah. kind of thing where either you like it or you don't. And、mm-hmm. it may be 50 50 of、mm-hmm. people. Even Japanese people,、uh, like a lot of、um, Japanese people I've met don't like natto.、Mm-hmm. It's not like, it, it seems like when you come first, oh, everyone in Japan likes natto, but it's、mm-hmm. not. Because <laughs> people in Japan know some people like it, some people don't like it, so they do. Okay, let's get them to eat it and see, don't watch their face. <laughs> Good. So, what's next in Japanese place? My place today is Ibaraki. Ibaraki? Okay. Ibaraki prefecture has Mito. Yeah. Natto, yes. From Natto. Ah, so it's the same prefecture. Yeah. On the sea. Yeah. And then they have 
There's, did you see? Big monument. Big monument? Pass to the Narita. Ah, no, I never. Oh, yes, I have. Yes, yes. Ah, that's in that's Ibaraki. Ibaraki. Ah, yes. okay. Yeah, yeah. Ushiku, yeah. Kanno. Yeah. Yes. Ah, uh -huh. cool. Yeah. Ibaraki is east side of Tokyo. Tokyo, yeah, yeah. There are many people yeah. go to Tokyo. Yeah. And working. what can Shopping, you. Working. Ah, so it's like a, almost like a bed town? Yes. Yeah. Moria. Yeah. Mm. So a bed town is basically where people who work in Tokyo and it's called a bedtime because you go to Tokyo, you work all day, then you go home and you just sleep in your bed. Mm -hmm. And so it's called a bedtime. Mm. So it's like a uh, in other countries, you maybe call it a commuter city or something mm. like that. So basically you're commuting in that Tokyo. Mm. Yeah. And yes. so what, what is there to do in yeah. Ibaraki? Ibaraki, go to sea. Yeah. Go to the sea. sea. Yeah. And, uh, ah, park, Kairakuen. Kairakuen. Mm. So what's Kairakuen? Uh, in Japan, has big three, big three, three big park. Nice, best three. Ah, the best three parks. Mm. It's in the best three parks. Mm. Wow. It's so. What kind of park is it? Ah, uh, many trees. Yes. Big and lake. People like beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Mm. So it's good for now. Like people are taking photos for Sakura and stuff. If people mm -hmm. go there, yeah, yeah. So, uh, and what else is there to do then in Iraqi? So you can go to the park. Uh, lake. There's a lake there. And the, yeah. the ball team. Yeah. Yeah. And then airport, Ibaraki airport. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Fine. Ah, that's, that's good, fun. good. Yes. I was in Ibaraki yesterday. Right. Uh, mm -hmm. or, well, mm -hmm. from when we, we recorded this, yeah, because one of, one of our friends uh, moved to Ibaraki yesterday, mm. so I helped them uh, move up there. So, mm. yeah. so I've, I've definitely been to Ibaraki. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, great. So what have we got next? Uh, do you know Shamisen? Shamisen. shamisen. Ah, ah shamisen. shamisen. So Shamisen is like the, uh, like almost like a guitar, mm, yeah. Yeah. Mm, but it's mm, traditional mm, Japanese yes, yes. instrument. Yeah. Yes, beautiful. Yeah. Shamisen. So sh Shamisen, uh, so it's traditional Japanese music. So if someone maybe watches um, older Japanese movies mm. or anime, mm. that that kind of um, music mm. in it, the traditional music, it has a shamisen. Mm. Yeah, it uses yeah. a shamisen. Mm. Yeah, maybe from no side Aomori yeah. or yeah. Um, but many people learn shamisen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yes. And then also kind of more modern uh, shamisen still like for uh, kind of more modern music videos and stuff they still use it mm -hmm. yeah? yeah yeah so um, you can maybe see on YouTube where there are like masters who play really fast because mm -hmm. a lot of the older music is kind of very melodious and slow and mm -hmm. but then you get um, more modern ones that kind of like fast kind of like almost like rock music yeah yes, yes, yes. yeah and uh, so, are there any famous shamisen players now in Japan? Yoshida Kyodai, Yoshida Brothers. Yoshida Brothers. Brothers. Ah, yes. Mm -hmm. So, and do they do concerts? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, if you come to Japan and you want to see some really, um, or listen to some really good music, then maybe go to one of their concerts. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Excellent. Yes. Good. Good. Yes. Can you play it? No. no. Do you know <laughs> someone who can? Mm, uh, Any of your friends? Mm, mm, yes. Mm, some. Yes. Uh, some. Some yeah. people. You know? mm. Ah, good, good. Yes. So it's not it's not rare to know someone who who can play. Yeah. Mm. Ah, excellent. Good, good. And can people go to lessons still? Yes. Is it easy to get yes, lessons? Yes, yeah. Yes. Okay. Great. Yeah. So, uh, shamisen, traditional Japanese culture, yeah. and uh, it, again, if you like music from anime or from Japanese music, mm. then. Uh, you've maybe been listening to it for a long time and not uh, realized, yeah? Okay, great. So what have we got next? Ah, uh, do you like baseball? Do you baseball? Like baseball? I know baseball. I don't How like baseball. How many people play baseball? How? In Japan? No, baseball. Oh, on a beef baseball team, 11. No, how many people play player? How many players? Mm. On one team? Mm. 
So on the field, mm. 11. <laughs> no? How many on the field? Nine. Nine? Ah, okay. I <laughs> told you, I never played base. I never watched baseball. At all. Mm. One time I watched baseball, we were in, uh, we visited your family mm. and the high school tournament was on. I watched some baseball, but otherwise, maybe one or two times mm. I saw like clips, not a whole bunch. Oh, yeah. Why not fun? You like baseball. You don't like baseball. You so, like soccer. Yeah, I like rugby. soccer. I like rugby. Um, I like I like games where it's where there's more where it's contest all the time. So um, like fast pace, whereas baseball can be um, everybody's waiting for the pitch. Mm. And so for me, it's it's kind of like cricket. Mm. Uh, it's and we used to play a similar game to baseball when we were younger called rounders which is kind of one of the games that um, predated baseball, so turned into baseball at a later date. So just games from the UK and from Ireland hmm. that when uh, people moved to America, then hmm. it became baseball. But baseball is huge here in Japan. Hmm. It's the number one sport in Japan? I think so. Yeah, yeah. and it's your number one sport. Yeah, yeah. 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 So who are, who are your baseball teams? Huh? Who are your teams? Who do you support? The Giants. The Giants? Yeah. And uh, how about in America, in Major League? Major League, Yankees. The Yankees. Mar Marinas. Yeah. I like. Yeah. Uh, Ichiro, do you know Ichiro? I know Ichiro, yeah. Ichiro. Ichiro is a very famous Japanese baseball player mm. who who did really well in the Major Leagues in America. Mm. Yeah. Yes. Please watch baseball. Baseball starts this end of, uh, starts April. Okay. So. And who are the defending champions? Um, I know SoftBank won it yeah, two yeah, years. SoftBank, yes, yes, yes. so SoftBank are probably the Pacific. the mm. the strongest team in Japan at the moment for the last few years. Yeah, Pacific yeah. is SoftBank's yeah. champion. is SoftBank yeah. separates Se Serigu. 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 Pa League. Okay, <laughs> Se League and Pa League. Pa League is the champion. SoftBank. Yes. Ah, yes. Seri, ah, Central League. Ah, Central, Central League, League is yes. Cup. 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 Yes. Yes. And Maybe this week, SoftBank also. Maybe. Yeah, yeah. And it's strange in, say, in Major League Baseball, everybody knows the the teams by their nicknames. So the Yankees or the uh, Red Sox or mm. whoever. And then, but in America every, or in Japan, mm. people know it by the sponsor. So SoftBank. Ah, but only SoftBank. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Swallows, Giants, yeah. Cup, the Tigers, Dragons. Dragons. Yeah. I only know. SoftBank. Yes. Ah, only SoftBank. <laughs> SoftBank yeah. changed company. So yes. before they uh, another name, but ah, I see. Yeah. Ah, now SoftBank yes. Hawks. Ah, the Hawks, but everybody says SoftBank. Yes, yeah. because SoftBank. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But then um, I know the Dragons because obviously uh, I live close yeah. to Nagoya, so, mm. but the Dragons aren't very good. <laughs> um, <laughs> They're so so. <laughs> in, um, in one of my elementary schools, um, the, not the, the Kyoto sensei, the next one down, the head teacher. Oh, yeah, head teacher. Shunin. Yeah, yeah Shunin Kyoto. Shunin. Shunin, Shunin, uh, his son um, was played baseball because he likes baseball. The dad likes baseball too. Mm -hmm. So every weekend they would play baseball and uh, on Monday we'd have class together. So I'd ask him, ah, what did you do at the weekend? Baseball. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then uh, then you say, ah, son's team. And then uh, did they win? Uh, so then sometimes it's like, one win, one loss, or another one, uh, all loss. And then one time he said, um, uh, his son's team, they lost, uh, 15 0. Mm. So he said, <laughs> not, not a fun day. <laughs> yeah. In Japan, uh, it's start early, six yes. years, start little league. Little league. They yeah. play six baseball, yeah. play baseball. Yeah. But maybe America starts. Hmm. 10, 12 years yeah, yeah, yeah. So the Japanese people only baseball, man. Yeah. yeah. Pain a lot. Yeah. Fast. Yeah. yeah. Retire is fast. Also. Yeah. It retires early. Mm. Yeah. Younger. Ah, I see. Yeah. 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 No good. Yeah. Good. Yeah. yeah. So what have we got next then? Next? 
Yes. Uh, do you know the uh, character snacks? Character snacks? In Japan. Yes. Only in, ja- only in Japan or another country. Yeah, like, like in, in Japan, there's a lot of special snacks. Mm-hmm. So we had, uh, for Girls' Day, we had a special snack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then we also had, sometimes there's a lot of special Kit Kats in yeah. Japan. Yeah, 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 People yeah. collect mm-hmm. lots of different flavored Kit Kats in yeah. Japan. What and do then, you think? Um, I think it's fun. It's fun oh, to, oh. to see these, uh, like when they do special things mm. uh, only for Japan that you basically can only experience mm-hmm. it here. I think it's good. Today I bought this one. Yeah. Um, yes, so we have these ones. Ah, 98 yen? <laughs> Is that how much it was? Yeah. Yeah. So, may, Star Wars. Yeah, if they're, if they're delicious and cheap, then that's good. So there's Star Wars snacks. Mm, okay, open, yeah. so we're going to open here. Snack and, um, what's it? Oma a toy. Toy. Yeah. Ah, it's like a Kinder Egg. Yes. Yeah. Chocolate. Yes. These are like Kinder eggs. In Japan, lots of many. When I was a kid, I loved Kinder eggs mm. because, you, uh, but I, I didn't really like the Kinder chocolate. Mm. I just liked making the toy. Mm. But now, um, before you would open it and there's lots of pieces and you have to put mm, it together. Yeah. Now it's like two pieces mm. and you yeah, just go, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's done. <laughs> they just make it easy. Okay, so is there any style? How do we open? Just bash or? Punch or eat? Punch? I don't know. It, so in Ireland, uh, when if you have an Easter egg, you punch it because the middle is hollow or inside in the middle, maybe there's mm. there's some chocolate sweets. So normally we just punch. Oh, these are, it, these are tough stuff. <laughs> the, no. no. Mm. 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 Yeah, so it's actually like um, Kinder chocolate on the inside. Same. It's got like white chocolate inside, milk chocolate outside, like a Kinder egg. So we'll eat some more and then we'll cut to the bit where we get the toy. <laughs> so you don't have to watch us eating for five minutes. So we have our toys here. We're going to open them and see what we got. Okay. Oh, you have yours ready. Cheater. <laughs> How do I open it? Ah, just squeeze. Mm. Okay, ready? Three. three. Ah. Okay. Who did I get? Oh, I think I got. Uh, I got one of the ships. Ah, you got a person. Ah, she's from. Um, she's from the new movie. Or not the new movie, the last one with um, Ray. So the first one that had Ray in it. So she's the lady when they said, oh, we need to go somewhere and she owned a bar. I don't know her name because I'm not a big Star Wars fan, but I remember her from the movie. If you show it Mask with- Kanata, Kanata, Star Destroyer. I got a Star Destroyer. Mm. Look at that, cool. Just show it on the top camera as well. We've got two cameras here, so it's going to be either on the camera or off the camera, depending on where I'm holding it. But um, you should be able to see that. And then you got a character. Yeah. So does it say her name? Maz Kanata. Maz. Maz Kanata. Mm. Okay, so um, she's obviously from the. She, I think she's in the last movie as well. She was definitely in the the, movie, the first movie that had BB-8 and Ray in it. And I'm pretty sure she was in the last movie too. So we got those. Um, I think we, we get R2-D2. Ah, the older oh. ones. Yeah, because that's what it shows on the front. On on the box, it has like R2-D2 and C-3PO. And, but I guess. Nah, this one. Mm. And then there's the, the newer one, yeah. So I think it's maybe it's like um, when they do like sticker collections. And so they have to have ones where people think, ah, I, I want to get BB-8 or I want to get, so then you have to get more and more. So the kids, every time they want a new one, I think. <laughs> but uh, how about the chocolate then? Oh. So the snack, was it nice? 
Ja. Ja. Yeah. Det er Easter, ne? Ja. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. So, nice chocolate for Easter. Mm. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so another thumbs up. Again, corn is the only one <laughs> that didn't get a thumbs up. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay. 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 What have we got next? What do you think the ramen? Oh is yeah, in Japan. Sounds. What do you think? I think when I came here first, I thought, wow, what did they do? <laughs> like, I, when I, because the first time I heard, it, I thought, oh, the people, it's just those people doing it. I didn't know everybody in Japan did it. Uh, but yeah, if you're if you're eating any kind of hot noodles, uh, you have to. <laughs> As people suck the, the noodles and some air in your mouth because the noodles are really really hot, and if you don't do that, then you're you're gonna burn your mouth. A but cold noodles also. Cold noodles too, but the the reason the reasoning behind it is is to get air in your mouth for the hot ones. But people do it with the cold noodles because it's the way to eat noodles. Yeah, yeah. But for me, I can't. For me, doing it, I can't do it because for me, it's rude. So, from my culture, it's like you know making that noise. Yeah, is is rude. Uh, but I suppose the longer we live here, I'll probably get used to doing it myself. But now hearing other people doing it, I don't think it's it's rude of them. It's just for like my personal uh, manners that I the way I was brought up. Uh, but it's it's very kind of. Um, If you go to a ramen shop and you don't hear that, then there's something wrong. <laughs> it's it's part of the experience of a ramen shop in Japan, and also it it means that um, you can eat you and other Japanese people can eat noodles a lot faster than I can because I'm like ah what the? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> whereas you just go <gasps> inhale. Yeah, some kids at school as well, like the um, that really like noodles, they just. <sighs> And then you look down, and the bowl is nearly empty. Mm. How does he get all that in your mouth? <laughs> it's, like, it's amazing. It's brilliant. Mm. And uh, when so you you've lived in other countries. Um, you lived in America. You've lived in Uzbekistan. You've lived in Australia. So have you eaten noodles there? Ah, like oh. like spaghetti. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> so not the Japanese way. Ah, I see. In Uzbekistan, yeah. noodles short. Yes, yes. In the Australia, maybe only hamburger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hamburger. If we uh, ate noodles, yeah. maybe only Japanese people. Ah, yes. Mm -hmm. So then Japan, the Japanese, Japanese restaurant. Yeah, yeah. Mm, I, think ah, so. I see. Ah, ah good. Yeah. So yeah, if you come to Japan and you go to a ramen shop and you hear that noise, it means that people are really enjoying the ramen. Mm. Yeah, because that's that's when you you're getting the the cool air in with the hot noodles, and people are really enjoying it because they're, they're eating it fast. Mm. Yeah. Ramen is fast. Yeah? Yes, ramen is very fast. Yeah, mm. but I like I like spicy ramen, and um, it's difficult to get spicy ramen mm. in Japan because. The, the tolerance for spice is a lot lower mm. um, in Japan. So even if you ask for spicy, you have to add extra to it. But uh, as well, when I came to Japan first, my chop skills, chopstick skills were okay, but it was very difficult to eat noodles uh, with chopsticks, but now I'm getting better at it. But still, uh, soba is still a little bit difficult mm -hmm. because they're, they're thicker. Mm. Yeah. Um, whereas ram, ramen is easy now for me uh, with chopsticks. Next time, good soba shop, ne? Yeah. <laughs> yes, soba udon also, ne? Yes, yes. So man. Yeah. So if you come to Japan, try and practice making the noise and fitting in with everybody. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Great. So yeah. what have we got next then? This week in Japan? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah. Do you know rando sale? Rando sale. Yes, I do because um, you showed me a picture earlier. But I know Rando Sal because uh, I've been an elementary teacher for mm. three years, mm. so all of my kids have them. So it's if you if you watch any Japanese anime that has elementary kids in it, you will know what a Rando Sal is. It's basically the backpack, the iconic backpack mm. that um, Japanese uh, elementary students 
have when they go to school mm -hmm. and um, it's their letter and yeah, uh, traditionally like a few years ago th maybe they were black yeah black and, red. black and red but now it's like you can get yeah, all different yeah, colors yeah. and there's like branded ones mm -hmm. and stuff like that and and how much is uh random sale what what do you think how much you you buy but use six years so so I, I thought when uh, when you asked me this first that maybe uh, Ichima in Nima in so that's about maybe between ooh, so in dollar terms um, maybe ninety dollars to one hundred and eighty dollars mm -hmm. kind of thing that's what I thought but um, what is the reality? Your money, your money. Yeah. So your money is is uh, four hundred or um, sorry not. Four, 400 yen um, like $400 uh, and uh, Goman in is like 50,000 yen so that's about um, $500 mm. uh, and then like the top of the range ones are like Nana Man in which is like $700 um, so like for for a school backpack even though you, you're using it for for six years mm. that's a lot of money for like um, uh, if like for parents to pay out yeah. Grand, grand, uh, grandpa pay, pay. grandparents pay mm -hmm. oh wow so uh so and then if they have um two or three um grandchildren they have to pay for each one mm -hmm. that's a lot of money isn't it yeah yeah, yeah. and but the, the the good thing is is that they're they're very long wearing they will last mm -hmm. six years and probably more after that as well mm -hmm. and uh they're the only thing is though they look very heavy mm. yeah are they heavy no no they're light, light. Yeah. yeah even uh, now when they pack all the books in <laughs> mm, lots of books yeah uh, so now many kids cho cho choose a car yeah yeah but sony company sony yeah sony both gave to the workers yes son, son or da daughters yes start elementary school. Yes. Company gave to Ransel. Oh, wow. Yeah. Maybe I think they don't choose. They can red, choose. Yeah. Red, red, red yeah, or yeah. black. Yeah, or yeah. So they add. So there's here's a free one, whatever color yeah, we have. Yeah, that's free. Right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mom and dad is happy. Yeah, they, yeah. Oh, they don't happy. have to pay. Yeah, yeah. Gra grandma and grandpa are happy too because they don't happy have to pay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> another, they paid another. Yes, yeah. or shoes yeah 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 yeah, yeah. but the the rancel ones now that I see as well is like the um a lot of the girls have pink or purple ones now yeah, yeah. and then they, they'll have like designs on them mm. with stars or hearts or, yeah and then they'll have um what what are those um the cute bunnies do you know that the, the oh, i can't remember the name but it's a set of characters now mm. they're like cutie Mm -hmm. um bunnies and stuff like that like that yeah, yeah. a lot of them have yeah, yeah, yeah. have those on them too like and yeah. um they're, they're they're basically one of the iconic things here in japan like that um uh, if you see the 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 satchel and then the yellow hat mm -hmm. yeah. is is yes. the way i always picture yes. like um elementary schools yes. uh, elementary children here in japan yes. and it's some some kids have um uniforms and some don't but as as long as you see the satchel, you know, like the oh, that's an elementary kid. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. So, so did you and your sister have Rancel? Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. And do you still have yours? No, uh, no. No. Do your parents? Did your parents keep it like yeah, as yeah, a memento? Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Cool. Really good. Yes. Yeah. So, uh, I think that's us finished for today. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So, are you ready? It's yeah. the score is four two. Yeah. John Kim point ah, no. another win for you <laughs> five five two yes. wow okay so um I'm a bit disappointed you won again <laughs> but we we need to say goodbye so that's it from us for another week um you know it's been great to see uh, people watching the show and stuff and 
Um, again, if you want to share it with your friends or post a comment or something like that, we'd really love to, to hear from you. But for now, it just remains for us to say, Johnny. Johnny. Mm-hmm. <laughs>